Today marks the first day of National Police Week. It's a week to honor and recognize the sacrifices law enforcement officers make every day. This week is especially important to one Central Illinois family, the Oberheim family. WCIA3's Marley Capper is live in Washington, D.C. Now, Marley, tell us, what does this week mean for them? Well, this week is really important. Officer Chris Oberheim's name is going to be recognized and it's going to be added to the National Law Enforcement Officer Memorial Wall. So like I said, it's everything to the family. Not only does this solidify his legacy, but this is really a reminder of the sacrifice he made to our community. In May 19th of 2020, Officer Oberheim was shot and killed in the line of duty when responding to a domestic call in Champaign. His wife and children and many family members have come. Also, 30,000 people from all over the country have come to D.C. to support their loved ones. There was 14 officers in the state of Illinois overall killed in 2021 and 472 all over the country. Now, this is going to be a week of coverage. We'll be here live in D.C. for the next few days as the events go by, and I will be here to report on the vigil where they'll be announcing his name at a silent vigil. Like I said, there's going to be 618 other officers' names that are going to be read at this silent vigil. And so this family, it's really a time to kind of find some peace and solace a year after their father and husband and family member's death. You can follow the journey on our website, WCIA.com, and on our social medias, on my Facebook and Twitter as well. Reporting live in our nation's capital, Marley Capper, WCIA 3, your local news leader. All right, Marley, thank you for that report.